as we ladies age, our midsection, shall we say, um, changes. <laughs> In today's podcast, you will learn three reasons why having a stronger core makes you look better, but why it's so important for your health. Hey everybody, welcome to the Shape It Up Over 40 podcast. I am your host, Nicole Simonin, and I am on a mission to end the idea that once you're over 40, it is all downhill. It is just not true. And my goal is to give you valuable information each week and every week on this podcast. So thank you for being here. Many clients come to me complaining of low back pain, increased waistlines, and why they can't seem to lose the belly weight over 40. So let's start off with losing weight or losing inches in your stomach. This cannot, I repeat, cannot be done with just ab exercises. You need to lose body fat all over. It will not just come from one area. Check out my previous podcast on knowing your body type and flatter abs over 40 for more on this. In order to lose those inches in your midsection, you need a program designed specifically for you. If you want to learn how I can help you lose your belly and keep it off, you can book a call with me today and I can help you. You can book your call at shapeitupfitness.com slash chat, C-H-A-T. As we get older, our core is very important to keep strong. And especially if you have had babies, you know, those little bundles of joy stretch out that stomach. One reason to work on strengthening your core is if you have back problems. Many clients come to me stating that they have back pain. The back pain could be a symptom of weak stomach muscles. If your abs are not firing correctly or you're carrying extra weight in your stomach area, then your back will take over and will become overworked, hence causing back pain. The body is amazing in that it works as a team. If one muscle is weaker or injured, other surrounding muscles will pitch in and take over. The problem happens when it's too much for the working muscle and it becomes tired or fatigued, or worse, overused. This is typically when pain and discomfort come into the picture. Learning how to engage, stabilize, and strengthen your core muscles may offset your back pain. If you are over 40, you may have gone to the doctor and they may have mentioned these words, pelvic floor, to you, maybe. If you haven't heard this mentioned to you, you probably will very soon. So the mysterious pelvic floor, what is it, where is it, and why should you be so concerned? The pelvic floor are all the muscles that line your pelvis. So I want you to imagine your pelvis as a bowl, and the pelvic floor muscles are at the bottom of the bowl. These pelvic floor muscles can be engaged by performing Kegels, Pilates exercises, planks, and other abdominal exercises. The most important thing I want you to remember is that if these muscles are strengthened, then urinary incontinence, or the ability to not sneeze and pee yourself, will be lessened. I think I'll just leave it at that for now. So if you want to not pee every time you laugh, jump, or sneeze, I want to invite you to join this October's Plank Challenge, where you can strengthen your pelvic floor muscles. You can request to join over on Facebook, just search Shape It Up Over 40 Challenges, and I'll also leave the link in the show notes. Did you know if your posture is quote unquote off, that your whole body could be imbalanced, which could lead to more injuries and those lovely aches and pains that you think are just from getting old? What if we made your posture more aligned and those aches and pains were diminished? That would be fun, right? So I was not blessed with good posture, I attribute my posture to starting ballet at age four and ending my professional ballet career when I was 30. This is where I really learned to stand up. But one of the things I didn't realize about my posture was that I wasn't always engaging my abs when I was standing up. So when I became a physical therapist assistant, I learned how the body needs to be aligned so you can alleviate injuries and have the body function, basically move easier and better. It's how the body should move. So think of it this way. It's like When your body's out of alignment, it's like trying to ride a bike with two flat tires. You absolutely will get where you need to, but the body frame of the bike will be all jacked up. So if you want to have great posture and function better and possibly eliminate some joint pain, you could go take a ballet class. But if you don't have any desire to don on tights and a leotard, you could just get better posture by engaging your core as you stand. So here's the extra bonus to having a stronger core. 
when you stand with proper posture and your abdominals are engaged, you will appear taller and thinner. But remember, you will also be supporting your bone structure and allowing your muscles and joints to move more easily. So there are a few other reasons why it's important to strengthen your core as you age. If you are serious about losing your extra weight for life and want to get started working together, book a call today at shapeitupfitness.com slash chats, C-H-A-T. And if you aren't quite ready, but you still want to learn about how to strengthen your core, join the Shape It Up Over 40 Challenge group on Facebook this month. Have a wonderful and productive day.